So water use is absolutely critical to Coca-Cola Enterprises. First and foremost, it's fundamental to our product. It's our key ingredient. But water is also used in our manufacturing processes. We have 17 manufacturing sites across our European operations. And water is used for the rinsing, the cooling, and the cleaning process within our site. So it's fundamental to everything we do. We also use about 9.5 million cubic meters of water a year. So it's critical to us in terms of our process and also to our product. So we've set ourselves a target to ensure that we lead the industry in terms of water reduction and we're making good progress on that. But equally, we set ourselves a target to ensure that we are a water sustainable operation. Now that means doing four things. That means first and foremost, protecting the sources of water that we use. It also means working to reduce the water that we do use within our own manufacturing sites. But at the same time, it means working to recycle and reuse the water where we can do, but also to replenish the water that we do use in our products and return that water to nature, particularly in areas where we're sourcing that water that are areas of water stress. So that's our four pillar strategy. The biggest challenge for us is making sure that we can demonstrate progress across all four of those areas. That's one of the reasons why we're really proud to have piloted and then received the Carbon Trust Standard on water, because it is proof that we are achieving that water reduction on a year-on-year -year basis across our manufacturing facilities. So we've made really good progress in recent years in terms of our water stewardship agenda. We've used technology, which has played a critically important role. So for example, we've put in place uh, water metering at our sites to enable us to measure and monitor real-time water use. And that's given us a lot of information about how uh, we're using our water and where we can be more efficient. We've also put in place and identified five different best practices in terms of water reduction. So you're helping, so using technology to help us on our water stewardship journey. Things like putting in place uh, recycle and reclaim loops in our sites using dry and semi-dry lubricants, all of which together as part of a site master plan has enabled each of our sites to take forward water uh, reduction best practices. But our people have been absolutely critical. Our people have played a really important role in driving those best practices across our business and making sure that wherever possible we are able to identify and then eliminate uh, water across our manufacturing processes. So our, pe our people have been front and centre of what we've been able to achieve. So we've been uh, working with the Carbon Trust for over five years now. Um, we started working with the Carbon Trust specifically around the whole carbon agenda. We were one of the first businesses to have our product carbon footprint certified um, via the Carbon Trust. I think that the Carbon Trust has a lot of expertise, both in terms of carbon, but now also in terms of water. So we were really pleased to be asked to pilot the new water standard. I hope that the Carbon Trust have learned as much as we have in piloting that standard. Our hope for the standard is that it can be rolled out across many different organisations so that organisations can benefit from the Carbon Trust expertise in terms of measuring and monitoring and achieving reductions, whether that's on carbon or water. So for Coca-Cola Enterprises, there are many benefits in working with the Carbon Trust and the Carbon Trust Water Reduction Standard, I think is really good recognition and proof that we are going in the right direction in terms of our water stewardship strategy. As a business, we clearly don't have all the answers. We have a long way to go to enable us to be in a position where we can claim to be a truly water sustainable operation. But the Carbon Trust Standard in terms of water is a great landmark. It shows that we're going in the right direction, but at the same time, it identifies where we can do more.